Hello everybody, I'm Yolanda, aka Creative Mommy of Two. And welcome, or welcome back. Today I have a review for you. Sorry that I have a bit of a shadow on the image here, but... Yeah, I did not want to show you directly how the image would turn out. So, today I have for you Rainbow Flower Power by Lars Stewart from the company Diamond Art Club. This is the original image. And this here is the actual diamond painting. So, now I can put that one way. <laughs> and also, over there, I have Luna. So, if you see something moving, that is Luna. <laughs> so, this is the top of the canvas. And as you see, we have a lot of sparkle. And this right here is the bottom. So, yeah, I can't show more in one go because, yeah, my table is too small. <laughs> This is a, let's grab my paper again, a 98 by 70 centimeters. It's a square drill canvas. And yeah, it's big and colorful. It has 61 colors and uh, three, no, six of them, six of them were ABs. So yeah. It has a lot of uh, shine because <laughs> yeah there were a big amount of AB drills that was it was the same but beautiful made placing them at times a little bit harder because yeah the wax was not always <laughs> wanting to cooperate but yeah it was amazing to work on. I started up there in the corner, left corner, and I worked down in rows because that way I could roll up the canvas. So yeah, I have not to have any place somewhere to lay this one when I'm not working on it. So I decided to section it off 10 sections. If I have seven sections wide, no, 10 sections wide, seven top to bottom, that was it. And then work two rows at the same time and then top to bottom, top to bottom, etc, etc. So yeah, I had a decent amount of changing colors. So yeah, I started this one on the 22nd of June and I finished it when I'm filming this yesterday. So most likely like a bit ago from when you see this. <laughs> but yeah, I finished this yesterday and that was the 14th of August. So. Yeah, it took me a while, but yeah, this was the first bigger canvas, the, also the first time-lapse project I worked on since I had my surgery. And there is Lucia. So that's my other cat, <laughs> in case you don't know her. But yeah, so uh, this was the first canvas I worked on since I had my surgery. So especially like the top corner, I worked like one section a day, while down here I worked three a day. So. Yeah, I guess that's a little bit of why it took me a little bit longer than I normally would have worked on it. But yeah, I absolutely loved working on it. I love how it turns out. I'm going to try to remember to somewhere here pop up an image of it like in one actual go <laughs> so you can see everything. But yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. It's one of those canvases that when I was almost at the end I was like yeah I want to start something new now but at the same time I don't want this to finish because it's just so beautiful I love this one and almost every flower that there is there's at least a few drills of AB only these three didn't I believe also that one over there not or none or at least just a few but yeah most of the flowers had at least like a few trails of AB in them so yeah there were a lot oh this one also didn't <laughs> and I look at it and I'm like hey <laughs> so yeah there might be a few where there's no AB but almost all of them had ABs so yeah I'm going to my tray a little bit more straight so this was one of the two bins I had my leftover drills in. This, this, these three, and that one are the AB colors. So, 
I'm going to grab the small ones because you couldn't see. So a light pink and a lavender. So 126 and 127. Then I had 113. I can't show them really well this time, but <laughs> yeah. Then I had 114. We oh, can see the shine on this one pretty good. I have a little bit of a shadowy issue at the moment, so yeah. Because my my camera arm is just not wanting to cooperate and stand upright like I normally have it. So yeah, I have a little bit more issues with shadowing. So sorry for that. But last is also the 120, which is this beautiful blue. And then I didn't get to fit everything in this container for the girls. So we need to shake this one upright also a little bit. Well, sorry, I'm job. So here I also have this leftover. These two were the only two that I did have a little bit of trouble with. I have not mixed them up as far as I saw. But the thing is, I'm going to move you around just a little bit. That's better, I hope. <laughs> but yeah, so the thing is, I was like looking around at certain points, like do I have, did I have the, the V or ha did I have the Y? So did I have the correct color here? So that was a little bit of a bit more of a struggle. So for all the leftover drills, I have my trusty container, so I can't put a lot of spare <laughs> leftover, well, leftover uh, trash drills, sorry. I can't put a lot of trash drills in this one. So yeah, it, uh, Looks like not much, <laughs> but actually also for it being such a large canvas, I think the amount of trash was pretty good because all I had was this. So yeah, I had some with a dot on it, a few with holes, a few that were concaved in the back and a few pieces of actual trash. But yeah, nothing, nothing strange. Yeah, I also had some ABs that had the AB coating on the back instead of on the front. So yeah, can't really use those. <laughs> but yeah, for the rest, quality was amazing. Drill quality was pretty good. I was pretty impressed with how well the drills fit together. Because I have the feeling that this canvas was one of the canvases, at least from Diamond Art Club, where everything fits together the best. So I didn't have as much capping as I normally would have. Still, obviously, I would have... Will, blah, blah, blah. Still, I obviously have some gappings, but yeah, not as many as I often have. So, yeah, that's great. Um, what else? Yeah, glue was everywhere, just... Normal canvas, as always, really good. Yeah. I basically have nothing more to say about this one other than it was absolutely a pleasure to work on. Start to finish, every drill I placed was fun. Yeah, love working on it. Would almost want to buy it again just to do it again. <laughs> Yeah, I love how it turned out. I'm pretty sad that I can't put it up somewhere, at least not at this point in time. So, yeah, we'll see. Maybe someday. Because I really would love to hang this one up. But who knows? Maybe I can someday convince my husband to put it up somewhere. <laughs> But yeah, as I said, I loved working on this. So if you're debating on if you would get this one or not, I would highly recommend you do this because it is absolutely beautiful. The only thing is, it's big. It's really big. But yeah, place it one drill at a time and you can get through it. It's not a race to how fast you can finish it. So if you're just like, it's so big, I don't 
know if I want to do it, just work on manageable sections. Even if you do just one section a month, as long as you enjoy your project, well, who's holding you back? But yeah, without that being said, I hope you liked looking at this gorgeous beauty, Rainbow Flower Power. I, as per usual, will link it down in the description below so you can find it. I don't know if this is at the moment in stock, so yeah, don't know. If it will be restocked, you will find the little bar that will say that you can get an email notification. You can get your, insert your email address there and yeah, you get a notification of when it's back in stock. So yeah, I highly recommend this one. It was an absolute pleasure. I can't say much more about it other than I loved it. So yeah, with that being said, before I ramble on for too much more, <laughs> I hope you liked it. I hope this is at least a little bit interesting for you. <laughs> Sorry for the cat. Even though she still has to wait another hour, hour and a half, she wants food. Which she's not going to get now, but yeah. <laughs> But yeah, I hope you like this canvas and the occasional walking around the table cat. <laughs> and I hope to see you in the next video. If you like this video, give this video please a thumbs up. That would help me out a lot. And yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. And as I said, I hope that you like this video. And I hope that I see you in the next video. Bye!